Hello. Hello, 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 hello. Hello, hello. As usual, I have to make sure. I have to make sure. Oh my god, I dropped my phone. Oh dear god. Let's see. Let's see if it's all working. It is working. Hooray. Hooray, hooroo. Oi. Oi, oi, oi. Okay. Welcome to Dredge, everybody. A new game. Dredging the Depths. Yay, our boat. Job listening. Angler wanted. Okay. Okay, dude. He looks so angry. Oh no, our boat! Dredge in the depths. Ba -ba 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 -ba. The morning light fills your eyes and you try to sit upright. You're lying on the cold, wet dock where you collapsed the night before. Ooh. A short man is shouting orders at a handful of workers disembarking from a boat nearby. The man notices you. Mayor. Welcome to Greater Marrow. I must say, quite the dramatic first impression. I see you've already introduced yourself to the jagged rocks along the bay. Did you not see the lighthouse? It was shining right at you. Oh well. I'm glad to see our new fisherman upright and breathing. Your boat was hopelessly damaged, but I've had a few of the locals move your things to one of our old vessels. We'll catch up later to discuss more details. I'll let you get out there to catch some fish. See if you can fill your cargo while you get your bearings in the light. Okay. Oh. Pursuit added, okay. Finally, I don't suppose I need to say this, but get back by sundown before the fog rolls in. Keep a close eye on the time. It can really creep up on you. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh. Beedy, 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 beedy. Ooh. Oh my goodness. Disturb water. Stock high. Start fishing. <laughs> Ooh, blue mackerel. Okay. <laughs> Another blue mackerel. Thank you. Thank you. What? Depleted? Come on. Pursuits. Catch fish for the day. Ah, oh, okay. Fresh start. Met the mayor of Greater Marrow, who sent me out to get some fish and find my bearings. Seems nice enough. Warned me to be back before nightfall. Those said something about the fog. Bit dramatic. Uh, da, da, da. The map? Ooh. Are these, like, the... Thannies and stuff? And I'm guessing this is the border of the world. Okay. Um, messages? None. And sack it up. Oh, there's some 128 fish. Oh my god. And there's so many aberrations. Oh my god, how long is this game? I'm not complaining, I'm so excited. Oh, we can turn on and off the light. Hurrah! Hello, fish. There we go. 
I'm like, how do I rotate you? One, two, three, four. One, two, oh, three. Yes, you're perfect. Depleted already? Time only advances when you're moving, fishing, you're taking other specific actions. Oh, okay. Oh, what? How dare you. How dare you say that to me. Do you know who I am? Oh, it's just the encyclopedia. Probably saying we caught a new fish. What is this? Lights, lesson effects, hawthorn, peasants known, spyglass, get a closer look. Oh! Okay. Ooh, what's that? Is that one of the messages? Uh, 20 of August, 1972, added to cabin. Uh, 20 of August, 1927, morning of the second day of the honeymoon and our first day proper. Today we're sailing around the islands and inlets at the back of the greater. We're sailing around the islands and inlets at the back of the greater marrow. I love the rocks here. The layers and colors are so striking. Furthermore, the fishing is relatively poor in these shallows, so I know... He will keep his hands on the wheel instead of the rods. He renamed the boat last night, Julie. He did a fancy renaming ceremony and everything. I think he took that more seriously than the wedding. Supposedly, it's very important to perform it correctly. Lest you want ill fortune to follow the vessel. He wanted to throw away everything with the old name on it, but I kept the keychain. Ocean, Ocean's Riches was a good name. I think he was prepared to a uh, surprise picnic lunch. I can see the basket half hidden, stuffed under a blanket at the front of the cabin. I love it when he tries to be romantic. Oh. Oh. Okay. Can we fish here? No. Can we fish anywhere? <gasps> Yay! Ugh. Ugh. Depleted. Aw. A bitty bitty boo. A bitty bitty boo. Yes, dog. Yes. You step onto the dock at Greater Marrow. The Marrow is waiting nearby. Yas. Ah, I see you've returned in one piece. Very good. Before you uh, head off to town, we should discuss the matter of your boat. As I mentioned earlier, your boat was too badly damaged to be repaired. However, I'm more than happy to sell that replacement vessel. Uh, yours to own. I understand you may not have the necessary funds on hand, so we'll consider it a loan, but I want to make this easy for you. Hmm. Until your debt is repaid, a tiny portion of your fish sales will go towards paying it off. A small amount of interest will go towards improving the town. So to recap, you'll need to sell fish to the local market, paying off your debt, and in return keeping the population fed and satisfied. Understand? Selling fish helps the town to pay off my debt. Got it. Where do I sell the fish? Hmm. Our local fishmonger will appraise and purchase what you catch. He's open all hours. Off you go then. Sell those fish while they're still fresh. Ooh. Ship loan with payments. 50 bucks. Oh. Fishmonger? You enter a squalid shack on the fringe of the marketplace. The familiar smell of fish fills the air. 
flies buzz haphazardly around a downcast man behind the counter. <sighs> You're the new fisherman, eh? Surprised they found a new one so fast. What happened to the other one? <laughs> he... It takes a certain type of person to last out, out here. It's not a life for everyone. Anyway, to business. I'll pay you for fish. Bigger and fresher means more money. Some species are just worth more, too. Other towns on other islands might pay you different, but while you've still got a debt outstanding here, I suggest you work on paying it off first. Mm. So let's see what you've got. Oh, I can just oh, okay. I only saw that now. Sorry. Mayor standing outside the fishmonger store. Excellent work. I have no doubt you'll be able to provide for this town. Look here, I found this down by the docks. I'm sure someone like you can make uh, something out of it. Why don't you take it? A research part. A curious looking component could be used to develop new equipment, but you need some investigation at the dock first. Uh, let's put you here. Oh, one last thing. Our local shipwright mentioned she might be able to make some modification to your ship. You should pay her a visit. Ooh. What's my storage? Oh, I'm guessing this is permanent storage. Okay. Fishmonger, we know what that is. Shipwright. As you walk into the yard, you see the shipwright making repairs to a damaged hull. Uh, she looks up at you briefly before turning back to her work. Ah. Introductions complete. Woo! Yay! You must be the new fisherman. I can make improvements to your vessel in the yard. Mind you, I'm not in the business of doing favors around here. Payment is upfront and everything takes some time to install. Also, if you take on any damage from the rocks or any damage at all, I can patch it up, mostly. She shrugs and gestures towards the hull she's currently attempting to repair. A number of wooden boards, all well above the waterline, are splintered and scratched. <sighs> Take a look around. Just remember, the bigger the equipment, the longer it takes to install. So plan ahead. Oh, no. Uh, simple skimmer. Two hours. Status operational. Fishing speed, plus 10%. Catches, shallow. A lightweight rod suited to catching fish that live in shallows. A small pool makes for limited. Hmm. We can also get engines. We can't get that. And then there's lights. Um, I guess we will get uh this. Okay. I think that'll do. Uh, let's see what research is. Ooh. Hydraulic rod. Fishing speed plus 50%. Catches oceanic. Mechanic assisted reels allow the catching of significantly larger species. Oh, huh. Engines. Improve outboard engine speed plus 15kn efficient propeller designs makes this a reasonable engine for those on a budget Ooh, i think i like that um i think i'd like the engine first thank you yay it's available in stores what the hell is this Jet drive engine? Oh my god. Uh -huh. A ship ride? No. Go here. 200 bucks? God. Okay. Um, 
Encyclopedia, we got Blue Mackerel, and we got Cod. Oh, Cod. Mayor, what can I do for you? That's about the blender reading. I should go back to fishing. Uh, let's go bottom to top. So, what happened to the last fisherman? Hmm, the last fisherman. Oh, he was unreliable. He'd go out at night, come back with no fish, and proceed and proceed to sleep all day. He was also a terrible captain. I mean, really terrible. Constantly running aground on the reef, even in broad daylight. The shipwright almost ran out of wood for repairs. No, he was no good. One evening, he left and never came back. So long, he shan't be missed by us. Now, what else can I do for you? I'm just gonna check if I ask it again, if it says the same thing or if he's like, oh, we already talked about that. Hmm, the last fisherman? Da, 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 da. Ah. It just repeats. Okay. I want to ask about the wider region. Certainly. Is there somewhere in particular you wish to know more about? Gale Cliff? Well, the main port over there is a place called Ingfell. It's right on the approach to the cliffs. You can't miss it. It's a whaling town, but I haven't heard much talk of it these days. I think quite a few people have left, one way or another. Is there another area you'd like to discuss? A uh, Stellar Basin. Mm. Quite a popular tourist destination. There's a re resort on the atoll built on top of a beautiful coral reef. Oh, I'm sure there's a wide variety of fish there. Maybe you fancy getting your hooks into some of those. Is there another area you'd like to discuss? Twisted Strand? Hmm. hmm. I don't think there's much to tell. It's just a tangled mass of trees. It's often blanketed in a thick fog, even during the day. You want some good lights and a good sense of direction if you're going to explore there. Ooh. Is there another area you'd like to discuss? <laughs> discuss? Uh, the Devil's Spine? Ah, yes. It's quite exciting, really. An active volcano amongst a city of ancient ruins. Oh my god. I must caution against sailing there, however. The ruins lie low in the water and would surely tear through your hull. Not to mention, the aforementioned volcano could erupt at any moment. You can occasionally hear it rumble from here. Is there another area you'd like to discuss? I think that's all for now. Uh, we already did this, and I know we can't pay our third debt, so whatever. Okay, let's rest until morning. And leave. Uh, beady, 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 bow. Can I fish here? Yes. Good. Ooh. Ooh, I caught a trophy. Okay. God. Thank God it's depleted. We're already out of room. Oh, we don't need that on anymore. A flowing bluery. It serves to match safe passive patch dangerous rock and its group hazards. Its dim light also provides a brief respite in gloom of the night. Oh, okay. A beady 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 babu. I need some more fish. Yes, please. Yes, fish are longer. I have a special order come through from a customer. If you can fulfill it, I'll pay you above normal prices. Uh, tell me more about the order. They ask for one golf flounder and one great eel. Just bring them in when you have them. Okay. You'll need to have a rod that can handle shallow water fish in order to catch those. The shipwright should be able to sort that out for you. 
Have you got any fetish for that order? Uh, not right now. You hold on to the fish for now. What do you got for me today? Sell all. And I think we're good. Okay, let's undock. Let me see. What are our pursuits? That's good. Fishmonger, bring your receive a special order from a customer. He says he'll pay well for filling your order. Go flown or great deal. Okay. We can do that. An encyclopedia. <laughs> this game is so relaxing. you. Can we catch sharks? Oh my god. Um... What? It's depleted already? Oh my god. Good one. Yes. Yas, queen. Bright lights and sleeping will reduce it. Oh, okay. Hey, fishmonger. Yes. Just leave whatever you have. I'll keep it in order and nice until you have it. Ready to go. Okay. All right, come back when you have everything now to regular business. Hey. Yes, yes, sell it all. Lousy weather lately almost makes you not want to get out of bed, but you and I, we've got to do it, eh? We're what keeps people from going hungry. Yeah, it's hard. Ship, right? No, no way. Um, almost. Can we get a new light down? Let's get a light. Thank you. Um, yeah, we'll keep that there. Um, I want that new engine though. So we have to do more. We have to do more. A hunch woman approaches you from the steps to the lighthouse. She stops from a distance away and looks at you with concern and visible apprehension. Uh. Lighthouse the keeper. Why are you here? I've come to meet people. I've come to meet the sea area. I'm gonna be honest. I've come to fish. Uh. There's nothing here for someone like you anymore. Do yourself a favor and move on. She turns and shovels back along the path that leads to the light. Well then, how dare you, Mayor? Just the person I was hoping to see. Will you be sailing out east, perhaps, 
towards Little Marrow. Would you give this package to the dock worker there, please? Wait, what does it say? It said something about the package feeling weird, and I ignored it. The mayor hands you a small, damp package bound in string. It's dripping slightly. The dock worker will pay you upon delivery. Please be quick about it. I don't want it to spoil. Don't forget to check your compass map if you get lost. Wait. Um. Oh, okay. I thought we could maybe ask about the weird lady, but okay. I am gonna guess. Yeah, that's for right across. Okay. Encyclopedia. Let's go deliver the package first. Beady 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 boop. Mm -hmm. This is so relaxing. I love it. So now, <gasps> those are flounder. We're going after you once we deliver this package. Yeah, it's Doc. <laughs> Doc worker. Hmm. What? A delivery? Let's see here. Uh, he tears a small hole in the paper and peeks inside. You can't see for sure, but it feels as though he's shielding it from your view. Mm. Yeah, nice and fresh. Those, this will do nicely. I'm to pay you, I suppose. He hands you some money. Mm. I was given this old book a few years, weeks back, but it didn't make much sense to me. You'll surely get me more use out of it. Sustainable fishing added to cabin. He pulls a crumpled book from his back pocket and hands it to you. A number of pages are folded over. Keep it in your cabin. Perhaps you can read it while you're on on the water. Stop by for a chat anytime. I know how lonely it can be. What did you give me? Uh, since I'm fishing. Uh, 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 okay. Selected as active book, past kind to read. Oh, okay. I know what this is. What's the trader? You enter a brightly lit shop. It's packed with antiques, the shelves full of jewelry and other baubles. An old man peers at you over the silver spectacles. Ah. Hello, is that? No. Ah, I don't believe we met. Forgive me. My eyes aren't what they used to be. I specialize in antiques and jewelry. I'll purchase any special trinkets you happen to have. Have you got anything nice with you today, perhaps? No. No, we do not. Undock. Hey, Flounder, I'm coming for you. Boop. Yas, Queen. Yas. <laughs> boom. 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 what this is. Can we fish it? Um, yeah, we could get a few. There we go. Um, and we can get one more. Yes. Baby boodaba. <laughs> Mayor, we're buying. 
Did you miss us? Of course you did. We're amazing. Um, yes. Have you any fish for the order? Absolutely we do. Hey. The fishmonger wraps up the fish and hands you some money. Good, good. They should be pleased with these. I've got another order here. This one's a little more curious. They want a couple of squid and a whole black grouper. Don't see many people fishing squid these days. They only feed at night. And well, you know, what nights are likes around here. Good luck. So the rest. The mayor is walking quickly towards you. He seems to be in a good mood with a spring in his step. Fantastic news! Thanks partly to your efforts, Greater Marrow is growing. Our town is sure to be swarming with visitors any day now. Hmm. In fact, I've granted a consent for the shipwright to expand her facilities. The old dry dock is operational again. I've also allocated some money to improve the fishmonger's services. He might have something to talk to you about soon. Keep up the good work. We're glad you've chosen to be here with us. Okay, what does the dry dock? Shipwright, this is the dry dock. We can make significant improve improvements to your vessel here. We're talking extra space, more attachment points for equipment, and even superior hulls. We'll need a decent stock of hard materials for these projects. Lumber, metal scraps, that sort of thing. Uh, how do I get materials? Finding materials will allow you to upgrade my vessel. Got it. How do I get materials? Uh. There's plenty of decent materials around the coast, from various shipwrecks and the like. I'm sure you'll find a way to get at them. Materials assigned towards upgrades here will be stored, so don't worry if you only have half of what we need. Oh my god. Hex spaces, engine spaces, light. Ooh. I want a new hull. I want more. Hmm. Okay. Have you seen that strange red light at night? It seems to be rising from the west. Got new pursuits. Two arrows skirt, one buck. On dock, let me just... I know what you guys. Um. Um. Hmm. Okay. Our light goes farther now. I see something sparkly. What's happening? The lighthouse towers above. Waves crash endlessly against the perilous rocks below. All creatures, human or otherwise, have their brittle bo bro bodies broken and thrown at its feet. You Ponder the intrinsic power of this structure, a vast column of stone, shouldering the responsibility of countless lives. How long will it stand? How long until it decays into ruin? Its purpose exhausted. The lighthouse towers above. One, two, three. I got one! Huzzah! What? I'm sorry! One, two, three. Aww. Let's deliver the grappa. 
and Zen. Have you got any fish for an order? Yes, we do. Boop. Here you go. Done. <laughs> All right, come back when you have everything. Now, to regular business, of course, sell the rest. Encyclopedia. Okay, let's head back out because we need to get squid and they only show up at night. Or is this a dumb idea? No, where am I going? This feels like a dumb idea. My light's not strong enough, I don't think. But I'll throw one right. Mm. I know there are monsters in this. Oh my god, what? There are scary eyes. What's happening? Run away! I don't know what's happening! Let's go to sleep. And let's talk. There's a message over there. Let's go grab it. Or should we? I don't know what we should do. There's so much to do. Can we grab this? We do not have the right equipment. How dare you? How dare you say that to me? It's this one. Don't know what fish that is, but we got it. What is that fish? Stingray, okay. Catch you. Come on. Eh. Eh. What? What am I doing? Come on. There we go. we can do right now. That's all we can do right now. Let's go sell some fish. Wonder if we can get the new engine soon. I'd like that. I'd like to get the new engine. Oh, don't please. Yes, please. I found this book out back. Could be useful to you. Rods, reels, and rigs uh, added to cabin. The fish monger reaches under the counter and hands you a damp, battered book. A few shimmering fish scales are stuck onto the cover. Oh my god! Sell them all. Ooh, we have 400 bucks. Shipwright. I've got a feeling about these engines. They'll take you far away. Reliable, too, provided you take care of them. Ooh. 
Ooh, ooh, ooh. Everything we can do. What about dry dock? Remember, you don't have all the materials from the store there yet. Yes, I know. That space is. Hmm. Uh, sustainable fishing: ten percent chance to not reduce fish stocks when catching a fish with a rod. Ooh. Sustainable fishing, a hefty tome of laborious read. It goes into great detail about techniques that can be employed to reduce the impacts of fishing upon fish stocks. Mention something about ensuring a healthy ecosystem for future generations. Rods, reel, reels, and rigs. Okay. Let's head back out, Sal. Because we need squid. Ooh, we're already much faster. There you are. So, so. Um, thank you. Eh, eh. Thank you. So, so. Thank you. So, so. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Aw, depleted. What you talking about? <laughs> I don't trust that. Something feels fishy. Oh my god. Fish monger. Got any fish for order? Mm. Absolutely. Just leave whatever you have here. I'll keep the order fresh and not my eyes. Yes. One. And two. The fishmonger wraps up the fish and hands you some money. I didn't think you had it in you. Night fishing is a tall order. Been meaning to talk to you about a new business venture I've been considering. Considering crab pots. I got one here for you. In fact, it's a bit banged up, but you could get it fixed at the shipwright. Crabbot can be deployed out at sea. Okay. What's it here? Ability to unlock crab pot. Deploy a crab pot. Don't forget where you put it. Fishmonger. Should be pretty straightforward. Just drop it out at sea anywhere, then come back after a day or two. Check up on it. Okay. I've got a customer after a fiddler crab and a common crab. Both species can be found around here. Uh, lousy weather almost makes you want to get out of bed, but you and I. Oh, okay. You're just saying what you usually say. Pursuits. Uh, caught to order. Hmm. Let's sleep until morning, because we're going crazy. Like the crop pot, and then okay. Yes. Yes, queen.
What? Bar veal, spine broken with sharp angles and crooked curves. A row of teeth bent on revenge. What? What the hell's your problem? Wait a minute. Ah, oh, we caught our first aberration. Okay. I see how it is. Can we catch anything here? Oh, that's too low. What about you? One more of y'all. Yes. Thank you. Grotesque fish. Show the fishmonger. Caught a strange looking fish. Never seen anything like it in all my years. It died as soon as it was pulled from the water, but its skills are still pulsing with a strange rhythm. Don't want to handle it anymore. Have headache and ears from ringing slightly. Maybe the fishmonger of at Great Merrill will know more. Okay. We're heading back anyway, so might as well. <laughs> what is it today? You hand the grotesque fish to the fishmonger. He grins, raising the fish up to his face before inhaling a deep, shud stuttering breath. Mm. Ah, now this is the sort of specimen to li liven up my day. Hmm, I wonder. He runs his fingers firmly along the length of the fish as though feeling for something. He pushes, he pushes from one side of the, its stomach and a small shape can be seen against the bulging scales. He slices the fish open from its stomach. He pulls a small piece of fabric and spreads it on the counter. It's a delicately patterned handkerchief. Well, I've never seen that before in all my days. I'll give you this thing, and I'll pay it for the fish, too, of course. It's not the first corrupted fish I've seen in these parts, so I'm sure you'll find more more before too long. I'll pay you well if you find any more. Okay. A once beautiful handkerchief drawn from the insides of a grotesque fish, patterned with a delicate crimson thread. Okay. Sell everything. A man is looking at you through your cabin window. His face is mostly in shadow. I know what you took to the fishmonger. And I'll be clear. I know he extracted an artifact, an artifact from it. I need to inspect it, but not here. Hmm. Meet me on Blackstone Isle. Head out of this bay and cut south. I have a business proposition that you'll want to hear. I'll be waiting. Okay... Oh, it's right over here. Yeah, it's not that far. I thought it would be farther. Uh, da -da -da. Um, actually... What are you doing? Let's go see if we got any crabs. I'm assuming maybe. Hmm. 
of them. Look. One. Thank you. Aw, oh, come on. Sell this fish, go to bed. Maybe there's something to do later. Uh, sell. Leave. Sleepy time. Sleepy time junction. Do. Ooh, common crap. Huzzah! I'm okay with that. Shibbity boo. A dibbity dow. A dwark. Um. Ruined mansion. The man is standing in a doorway watching you approach. He's holding an old book in one hand. It's bound in crimson with silver, with silver ribbons. You came, good. Allow me to introduce myself. I am a collector of many things, art and artifacts, treasures and truths, and curios that occupy the periphery of desire. And you have something for me. Handkerchief removed from inventory. You give the handkerchief to the collector. He holds up into the flickering light and studies it. Hmm. These patterns are unmistakably. Even after all this time, this handkerchief comes from an old ship I've been searching for. It sank many years ago. It carried items of great importance, as you can imagine. Retrieving them is proving to be a challenge. That's where you come in. My proposition is this. I will outfit your vessel with equipment that will let you dredge the wrecks in dark depths. Find these lost artifacts and I will reward you in ways beyond all imagining. Uh, pursuit updated. Ooh, you need not give up your fishing career. I merely need a few hours with your vessel to make the necessary alterations. What do you say? Let me think about it. I accept. Mm. An excellent decision. I'll prepare the equipment immediately. Dredge crane added. The relics we're looking for are a ring, a necklace, a watch, a music box, and a key. I would encourage you to ask around the towns about shipwrecks or other strange occurrences. Anything that might be worth investigating. Return when you have something. Workshop. The workshop looks as, as though it has been used in decades. Go inside. You enter, taking a moment to let your eyes adjust to the dim light. What do you want to do in here? Pick up items. You find some horrifying creations among the detritus. Sign of Ruin. A symbol of the deep is carved into the small talisman. It's sure to draw attention of those attuned to it. Oh, no. Uh, arterial engine. The bony blades of this grotesque engine are driven by a pulsing heart. It beats in time with your own. Uh, I'm gonna leave those there, because those are freaky. What is it? Where should I look for relics? You should ask around the town to... In the marrow, somebody is sure to know something. Anything else? Uh, nothing. I'll be going now. Oh, okay, I'm back. Um, let me see. Uh, da 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 da. Wait a minute, I can dredge now. Can't I? Yes. There you go. Thank you. One, two, three. Yes. 
and depleted. Trying to remember where I've seen dredge stuff. I think here is one. Can I grab it? Ooh. Oh, okay. Worn gold ring. Okay. At least I understand how it works now. Shoot a booty hoodie hitty hitty how a bitty bow We'll be right there. Have you got any crabs for that order? Absolutely. Don't forget, if your crab pots get a bit worn out, the shipwright should be able to patch them up. Here you go. Uh, done. All right, come back when you have everything. Now to regular business. Yes. Uh, sell all this. Thank you. Um, builder. You approach a woman sitting on the dockside, staring out to sea. She turns to you. Mm. What's it like out there? It's peaceful. It's difficult. I don't want to talk about it. I would say it's peaceful. It's got to be a damn sight better than this bloody town. I think I just need to get away for a while. Maybe not come back. Going backwards is a mistake, don't you think? You should always keep moving forward, moving along. It's not so bad here. I don't want to move along. I can't move. I can't. I can't go back. I can't move. Oh my god. It's not so bad. She's gazing out to sea again, lost in thought. Say, if you find me some materials, maybe you can help me move. I mean, really move. There's an island I've heard about, Steel Point, just in the north. Two new units of lumber and two units of scrap is all I need. I can make a new place for myself out there. You'd be welcome to visit, too. Yeah. Just stack it up at Steel Point when you have it. Anything. I'll pay you when the job's done. Ooh, okay. What is it? Um, let's go bottom to top, ask her usual. What do you know about the area? Greater Marrow? Well, it was once a bright and thriving little town, if you can believe it. There was plenty of work for me and my crew, new houses and shops every other month. We had a fair bit of money out of it. But I don't know. I guess the bubble burst or something. I don't know how these things work. People started leaving. My crew left. I stayed. Anything else? Why do you want to leave? There are too many painful memories here. I don't want to be living with them anymore. It's a bit difficult to talk about. You know how it is. It doesn't do any good to dwell too deeply on the past. Anything else? What did you want me to do again? Bring two units of lumber and two units of scrap to Steel Point, which is an island just to the north. I want to build a place for myself there. Anything else? No, I better get on with it. Mayor. Um. Let's see. We already talked about this. What do you know about any strange occurrences? Well, I heard that my counterpart in Little Marrow met the most unfortunate end. They say he went and mad quite suddenly. One day he was normal, the next he was pacing the shoreline, hurling people's belongings into the sea. After some days like this, he disappeared, never to be seen again. Nowadays, the tale of the old mayor is used to scare children. Not many remember him, myself included, and those that do rem remember don't seem to like talking about it, a most unpleasant subject. Now what else can I do for you? Um, do you know any shipwrecks around here? Shipwrecks? Unfortunately, there have been quite a few in the recent years. The lighthouse helps, but even it struggles to cut through the, the fog some nights. 
We do our best to salvage and clear any shipwrecks that occur around this side of the island that should make fishing a bit easier for you. Around the back though, it's a little harder to get to. There are still some wrecks towards the deeper patches. You'll want to avoid that area. Now what else can I do for you? I want to ask about the bigger region. Certainly. Uh, certainly. Is there somewhere in particular you wish? Blackstone Isle. Hmm. I don't know a great deal. It technically falls under the jurisdiction of Little Marrow. I believe it was sold to a private owner some 20 years ago. They must have special arrangements. Such a sale is quite uncommon. Very complicated paperwork involved, you see. I've not met the owner. I su suspect they don't live around here. The island seems quite uninhabited. Is there another area you'd like to discuss? No, that's all for now. Uh, I should get back to fishing. Oh, Lighthouse Keeper. <gasps> lighthouse Keeper, what is it? What do you know about the old mayor of Little Marrow? <sighs> that's... he's... I try not to think about him. There's a painful memory for us all now. Some nights I still think I can hear the hum of his engine sailing past the bay. But I know he's gone, and I don't want to think about it anymore. Who lives in Blackstone Isle? Mm. I see a lot from up here, you know. I saw that ill-fated boat return. I chose to look the other way. I watch an unnatural glow flicker through those windows. Whatever you've got planned, I hope you know what you're you're doing out there. Have you heard of any strange things happening? I see plenty of strange things from atop the lighthouse. Sometimes I don't know whether or not I can trust my own eyes. She holds the lantern up so that it shines brightly onto her onto your face. Are you really standing here in front of me, or is this just another of the fog's tricks? Do you know any shipwrecks around here? She eyes you suspiciously. Mm. There's a spot near the back of Greater Marrow where the cur current carries in wreck wreckage from the sea. Some nights you can see an unnatural glow rising from that patch of dark water. I can't imagine what's down there in the deep. So if you're looking for what I think you're looking for, it's best you just move on. I should go. See. Rods and wheels. Rods will reel fish 10% more effectively. Straightforward, simple techniques on operating equipment more effectively. Not much I already didn't know though. Okay. Um, and then there. Okay. Number scrap and uh, search for the relics. Uh, the collector has installed dredging equipment on my boat, and to locate some relics for him, he said he'll reward me for any. I return to him at Blackstone Isle. Checking out shipwrecks and the like would be a good place to start. He mentioned that the locals would be able to point me to some. A place to rest. I spoke to a builder on the dock of Greater Marrow. Can't talk about moving on, didn't seem entirely with it. I was trying to help bring materials to Steel Point Island to the north so they could build a house there. I'm sure I, I can dredge up something. There's some good wood and some wrecks. Uh -huh. Okay. Um, Shipwright. Uh. If you're wanting to get a bit more of your engines, take a look through this book on the house. She pulls a book from a toolbox nearby and hands it to you. A few of the pages are stuck together with grease. Ew. Gross. Icky. A dry dock? Remember, you don't have all the... Okay. Oh, that's the new book. Cool. Correct engine operation. Okay, let's start reading it. Rest! Did we get any more crabs, 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 crabs? Pick up. Eh, might as well 
grab a bunch of fish before we head back. Ooh. Ah. What is that? It's all swirly and purpley. Oh, grotesque mackerel. Is that what that means? Well, I guess now at least I know. Note to self, if you see swirlies above a fishing spot, it means there's a weird fish there. A really weird fish. later. First, let's sell the jewelry to this guy. Grieving father. Okay, let's do trader first. Welcome, found anything special? Sell all trade clothes. Uh, dock worker. How's the day treating ya? Let's talk to him. What's it like working on the dock? As changeable as the weather, huh? Most days it's pretty quiet. The pay's not too great, but the work's straightforward. That suits me to a T. It's good to get a fresh sea breeze without actually being on the water. No offense, but you wouldn't get me on one of those seas on those seas every day. What else can I do for ya? What do you know about us, any strange occurrences? Mm -hmm. I overheard a tale in the tavern some years ago, it sounded pretty strange to me. Supposedly, some 20-odd years ago, a fisherman from these parts hauled up an old sealed casket from the seafloor. They pried it open and took what was inside for themselves. That very night, the fog rolled in for the first time, and it has cloaked the seas every night since. What was in that accursed casket, nobody knows. All of the crew that laid eyes on the contents went mad, of course. Or worse. The casket, the casket and crew have disappeared without a trace, but the fog remains. Crazy stuff, huh? What else can I do for you? Do you know of any shipwrecks around here? I know there are a few around the eastern side of the island, mostly rotted away by now, I had to expect, or dashed apart by the waves. Poor souls keep hitting rocks in the fog. I guess there's a blind spot back there where the lighthouse can't be seen. People get turned around. What else can I do for you? Do you ever pro process shipments for Blackstone Isle? <sighs> that old ruin? Doubt it. I doubt it. Uh, let's see. He flicks through a large logbook and appears to be a record of shipping manifests. Thought so. It doesn't ha even have a shipping address. As far as I know, nobody lives there. What else can I do for you? I better go. A grieving father? Grieving father. Hello, is everything okay? Uh... Do you know of any strange occurrences? I don't get a lot out a lot anymore, so I don't see much of what goes on. But I do remember the old mayor in his final days. What an awful sight it was. Screaming and throwing things into the ocean, into the sea. Throw it back, he would cry over and over, begging anyone who would listen, howling it to the wind. These days I almost feel like I understand. Anything else I can help you with? Do you know of any shipwrecks around here? Well, yes, you see. My only son was lost at sea some years ago. He's still out there somewhere, in one of those wrecks, all alone in the cold, dark water. The man is clearly trying his hardest to remain composed, but tremors of grief wreck his body. Oh dear. Excuse me. I was wondering, I noticed you have some dredging equipment installed on your vessel. 
If you're able to retrieve any of his belongings from the wreck, I think he'd feel more at peace if his mementos were with me. He wore a bronze belt buckle, especially engraved. I recognized recognize it anywhere. If there's a chance you could find it, I'd be in your debt. Anything else I can help you with? I better go. Okay, let's undock. Ooh, there's a weird fish there. But we can't get it right now. Let's repair. Let's repair. Let's repair the crab pot. Do 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 do. And go on. Yes, fishmonger. Hope the seagulls didn't, didn't get your most blasted things. I think they're all fresh still. Yeah, they're all fresh. Yas, yas. Looks like some of your equipment could use some fixing. We can repair that here. Uh, yes. Thank you. You're good now? Yes. Okay. Right off. Encyclopedia? Grotesque mackerel. Caught one. Pursuits. Lost at sea. Find a belt buckle in your little marrow. Met a man in little marrow who lost his son in a shipwreck some years ago. Said they'd never found the body. He wants me to try to look for his son's personal effects. Mentioned an engraved belt buckle. I should check the nearby wrecks around the island. Um, let's go to sleep. Now we can leave. Okay. There's a drinking spot. would metal be? Huzzah, metal. Thank you. Um, can I back up? Yes, I can. Thank God. 
Thank God that's an option. Uh, ooh, bronze belt buckle. Thank you. Yoink. Twenty first August nineteen twenty seven. I almost said seventy two. Ooh, we read a book. Good for us. Good, good. Hey, my dude. Hello, is everything okay? About that belt buckle. You give the belt buckle to the man. Give oh, give the belt buckle to the man. Yes. Give the belt buckle to the man. This is. This is his. Oh, thank you. Bless you. You've returned him to me. Please take this. I'm not any money to pay you, but this might hold some value to you. Ooh. A research piece. Absolutely. Anything else I can help you with? I better go. Um, let me see. Did we complete? Yeah, we completed it. Messages? 21st August 1927. We had a slight accident yesterday around the shallows at the ba back of Greek Romero. A rock seemingly appeared out of nowhere and struck the front of the boat. It did not penetrate the hull, but it jostled us around and a few items fell overboard into the water. We do not see what they were, which is some concern, but we believe all important articles are accounted for. He has been checking over some notes from the boat renaming ceremony. He is paranoid that he performed the steps incorrectly. I have never known him to be so superstitious. Ooh, Ooh engines provide 5% more movement speed. Ooh. A preaching and disjointed set of articles on how and how not to operate engines. In general, it was far it was far too over cautious for my thinking. Mm. Mm, yes. Let's rest till morning. Undock. Did we catch anything interessante? Please say we did. Are you kidding me? Fine, I'll take it. Which reminds me, um... It's up here. Right? Going the correct way? Yes, I am. <laughs> Let's help this lady build her house. <laughs> yes, stop. Steel port. Material pie. This is the island where the builder wants materials delivered. Uno. You've delivered all the necessary materials. You should let the builder know. Yas, yas. Oh, yeah, on dock. Wait, what? Oh. 
was like, are those materials? I want materials. Give me materials. But no. No, it's not material. Dang, name it. Hey, girl. Yes, you. Builder. <sighs> You've done it? Well, no sense in wasting time. Let's get moving. Good rinse to you, Greater Marrow. I'm onward bound. Um, research? Uh, da -da 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 -da. I'm gonna say yes to this, because it only costs one. Pursuits? Okay, let's go. Don't worry, bestie. We'll deliver you. I just hope you're okay with us staying the night. Because, you know, it's getting dark. Or it's gonna get dark. You know what I mean. You know what I mean, bestie. <laughs> Yes, yes, this'll do. Thank you, fella. Give me a short wall to get my things built here. You're welcome back anytime. She reaches into her tube box and pulls out a hand handful of components. Yeah. Take these. Always good to have one on, on hand. Oh my god, research! Yes. Yes. Yes, we're gonna research. What do we want to research? Efficient crab pot lasts for three days. With improved design, this crab pot, sh pot should be more effective at catching creatures. Uh, additional strength that allows the cage to last longer in the water. A more space efficient design allows this pot to hold more before it needs emptying. Ooh. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Flexible fishing pole. Fishing speed, harbor design allows for a more flexible fishing style. Uh, let's do this one. Yeah. Go us. Let's sleep. And then undock. Then we're gonna harvest these materials over here. Is that metal? I want metal. Give me your metal. Yes, please. Hiya. back over here and put the materials we got into storage if we can. Because I don't want to go all the way back when we can still get. We can't put them in the storage? Come on. That's Bulbatoo. Oh well, we got a lot. Let's rest and then head back.
Hey yo! Um, let's go to dry dock. Don't worry, I know. Um, uh, da da da. Two rod spaces modifies two cargo spaces to hold the rods. Okay. Um. Four net spaces modifies for to also hold the nets. Two engines, one of two cargo spaces to hold the engine. Okay. Ooh, we can do that one now, kind of. Yeah, we have a bunch of money. Let's do it! So it's done, and we don't have to worry about it anymore. E. E. Purchase. Two engine spaces. Hurrah! One of one cargo space to also hold lights. Oh, yeah. Uh -huh. Ship, right? Shallow, shallow. What do I have? Uh, shallow and coastal. So this one does the job of both of them, so... Buy. Uh, let's put that storage. Sell this. Sell that. Um, let me see. Storage. Pick up. To cargo. Um, da da da. And install. Yes, please. There we go. Can we also get this? No. We need more money. Okay. Oh, something rotted away. Okay. Okay. We just gotta throw it. Okay. 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 Undock. Let's see if we got any crap. Any, any crap, any crap. Oh, come on. Take off. Guess we should catch some fish because we need at least 400 buckaroonies. Thank 
you. What the fuck? Blumpy mackerel. Oh my. Mmm. <laughs> what? Depleted already? How can you do this to me? Ooh, there's some weird fish up tonight. <laughs> oh my god, what? Brood squid? Ooh. I caught a trophy one though, so. You know. Oh, good. There we go. I'm gonna dock it up. No. Encyclopedia. Take a little smell from a growing core inside a gelatinous sack. Other crows leave dormant alongside. Oh my god. Fishmonger? Yes. I mean, no, he already got it. Sorry. Fell. Thank you. Um. Hmm. Should we grab more crab pots? Don't know. Yeah. Ship rides. Can we buy this thing in a boober? We can. Yas Queen. Install it. Yas, yas. Here, put you on there. Oh, and it even tells me. Yes. How do we get cloth, though? God, you're cheap. Like, not you're cheap, but like, the upgrades are cheap. You know what I mean. You yeah, know. Uh, rest until morning, please and thank you. Uh, Undock. you? Nah, I don't want to. Mm. I want bigger fish. What about you? Nah, 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 nah. Bronze Whaler. Good, I guess? I don't know. Um. Shit. Eh. Goddamn. Eh. Eh. No! There we go. 
Let's go sell this. Hopefully it's for a lot. Because if it's not, I will cry. Ooh, okay. Okay. Hey, fish guy. Fell off a fish. Thank you. I should really talk to the relic dude. Um, still don't understand how we're supposed to get cloth. Okay. Let's just grab more money for now. Boom, 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 boom. Come on, I want the weirdo. Oh my god. Well, now I know. And knowing is half the battle. Fishmonger. Look at this weird fish I caught. You know what? Actually, I'm gonna buy one more. Yes. Uh, Voltaic Groper. An unknown green energy arcs and crackles over the fish's scales. It thrashes cease ceaselessly, even hours after being pulled from the water. Ooh. We'll catch them all eventually. Um, let's rest. Hopefully we finally got that goddamn crab. But 
there's only one way to see. Only one, only, only, only one way to see. Hey. <gasps> yes, queen. Thank you. Now, let's go complete that thing in my boob. Fish are you again? Why not? We need money. I think I've been overfishing this area. I'm starting to get less fish here. Hey! Grenade crabs? Absolutely. Don't forget, if a crab pot gets worn out, the shipwright will be able to fix it. Sure, whatever you say, dude. Here you go. Fishmonger wraps up the crowds and hands you some money. These'll do. Glad you got some use out of that old pot. Can always buy more here. Or repair damaged ones at the shipwreck. Mm -hmm. I have one final request for you. As you've seen, some fish around here can develop odd deformities. What do you think happens to a person that eats the flesh of one of these mutants? Nothing. They get sick. They go mad. I'm gonna assume they go mad. Well, perhaps, but I want to know for sure. Bring me a mutant fish, any will do. Just keep this between the two of us. Okay. Okay, weirdo. Pursuits. Grab one weird fish. Got it. Fiddler crab, yay! <laughs> Do we also have to dredge up cloth? I wonder. I wonder if we do. Oh, wait. All that's left of this bow is an old husk. You pull a little closer. Look inside. Ooh. Thank you. I'll take that. I'll take that. Old iron chain. Junk to untrained eye, but there's a good metal here. Someone might pay for this. Oh, okay. And citric ring. A gold ring clasping a golden citron. Okay. Thank you. Inspect. The stone hums quietly, sending ripples through the air around it. Faint shapes dance upon its surface, vanishing before one's eye can focus on them. Place your hand on the stone? Sure. The cold stone does not respond to your touch. Thank God. Thank goodness. Oh, it's just fish. Okay. Who cares? Who cares? It's just fish. A pile of loose debris clearing this path could take some would take some strong explosives. More wood? <gasps> no! <laughs> Thank God. Oh my God, I'm so sorry. I'm sorry I'm dumb. No, don't be depleted. I want more cloth. I want more, dang it. Oh, well. Ooh, there's an aberration over there. Let's drop everything off first so we don't lose it. In case that's a thing. Oh, 
What do we have? Dry junk. Uh, what do I want first? Uh, my dress rod spaces would be more useful. To research. Let's put this into our storage for now. Because I don't know what to do with it. Okay. Let's undock. Let's go catch that weird fish that the guy wants. Here you got weirdo Tusk Groper. Ooh. And now to go back. Do -do 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 -do. Did our light break? Fishmonger. Have you got any of those mu mutants with you now? Yes. Remember, any Everett will suffice. I suspect they're all the same underneath. Here you go. This fishmonger takes that aberrated fish from you. He clutches it close to his chest, wringing his hands around its slimy body. Mm. Yes, this should do nicely. Here's what the fish is worth, and why don't you take these two? They're of no use to me. Oh, yes. Yes. Thank you. Hmm, do you hear that? It sounds like the faintest whispering. You listen. Silence. In the stillness of the room, the fishmonger's hands begin to tremble. His face grows anguished. Please, sell what you need, then leave. I must deal with this creature quickly now. Oh, okay. Ah, uh, here you go. The fishmonger's door slams behind you. You hear the heavy scraping of a metal bar sliding across it. The fishmonger's door is barred from the inside. Did we do a bad by helping him? Did we do bad by helping him? I don't want to do bad. We don't got anything. But we do have more of these now. So we might as well try and research something. But what? Maybe a new engine? This engine is outfitted with a dual propeller system, increasing speed. A refined outboard engine. High quality components and efficient craftsmanship. A reliable engine trusted by seafarers. Um, let's do this one. Yes, yes. Shipwright? No. Ooh, that costs a lot of money. So let's go to sleep. Then jump over to the antique store guy. And sell what we got. Also, we need to check. We need to check our craft pots. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
Yes, I have. Here you go. Fishmonger? Barred from the inside. But I need to sell my fish! Can I t Can I talk to the mayor? What can I do for you? Uh, ask for a reason. Reason. No, that's all. Okay. I want to talk about the fact that I can't... I need to sell my fish. Fishmonger. Okay, what if I rested until dawn? Will he be fine tomorrow? I hope to god my fish aren't ruined. Fishmonger? Ugh, blinded headache today. Did, did you come by yesterday? I don't recall. Anyway, what can I do for you? Sell all of them. Okay. At least you're back. Encyclopedia. Oh. Oh. Uh, Shiplight. Buy that. Uh, to storage. Uninstall. To storage. Uh, sell that. Go to storage. To cargo. Put you there. There we go. There you go. Why can't I sell this? Peculiar engine. Someone's turned this engine into an unfamiliar way. Whatever they did seems to have given it more power than normal. Okay. Uh, what do we got? If we sell the light, how much we get? Yeah, let's sell that. And get this one. Yeah. Okay. I think we done good here today. Oh my god, we're so quick. To the open waters. Let's see what we can get. 
like, what are you? Oh, we know what you are. But I don't think we know what you are. Eh, eh, eh. Oh, we kind of do. Oh, well. Eh, eh, eh. Yes! Yes! It's so good. No, don't do this to me. No, I don't want to discard it. This one. This one we can discard. Unless, is there some way to do this weird? Uh, like, I put this there and that there. Thank God. Oh, uh, we can get one more. Right? Right? Or am I just dumb? I'm just dumb. I thought we could fit one more here. But I'm dumb. Discard this. Are there any materials we can get around here? Specifically claw? Shapes in the deep? Relic? The key? Ornate key place. Oh, I don't think I can get that one. Hurry to home. already? Oh my god. Let's sleep until morning. And then, after we deliver the key, we'll probably have to say goodnight. Because I have work tomorrow. BD ducks. While we're at it, we might as well. Might as well grab all of these. for me. That is a freaky looking fish. So freaky. Actually, is that all the ones for the mackerel? Yeah, we caught all the aberrations. Good for us. Ruined mansion. You enter the collector's house. He's standing at the back of the room, still holding the silver and crimson book. He seems impatient. Well, you have something, don't you? Show me. You hand him the key. The cold metal shimmers the strength. The key. Deliver the key. Oh, achievement unlocked. The cold metal shimmers a strange shine as he holds it. The shape of the key, the teeth, the head, now somehow seem changed smaller. Has it always been this way? Hmm. Is this all? Where's the lock? The collector grows agitated. It seems 
the pieces we're looking for have traveled further than I anticipated, anticipated much further, I suspect. In that case, allow me to aid your travels. He turns a few pages in his book and mutters something low under his breath. A burst of light fills your vision and you stagger back briefly. Billy unlock haste, otherworldly speed at a price. Collector, now go. You have more relics to uncover. My intuition tells me that the current current may have carried some debris to the southeast towards Gale Cliffs. Make that way your priority. I'll mark a location on your map where you can begin your search. Anything else? Uh, let's see. Do you know who owned these relics? Yes. Who? He looks at you for a moment. A look of something like regret flashes in his eyes. An old friend. Anything else? How long have you lived here? Hmm. Quite some time. I used to be a fisherman, as was my father before, but two decades ago I took up residence here. I need, needed to focus on other endeavors. I found it that this I found that this island was, has a certain strength to it. Those dark basalt columns stretching to, downwards into the deep. Anything else? The words you read from that book, what did they do to me? The book holds power from the deep. I merely extended its powers towards you. Is there one in particular you wish to know more about? Haste. The words of haste are instant and cruel. They will impart a terrible speed to your vessel. But be warned, however, it may put a great deal of stress on your engines. Hmm. Are there other powers you wish to know more about? We're gonna get more powers? Never mind. Uh, nothing more. I'll be going. And with that, we must bid you adieu. I hope you all had a wonderful time. I know I did. I'm actually really loving this game so far. I'm really sad that we didn't leave the shallows sooner. But, you know, we gotta upgrade our boat. But, uh, yeah. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope to see you next time. And have a wonderful day, night, evening, or wherever. Whatever time it is where you are. Okay? Bye!